Hi guys, it's a great day out here at Johnson RV in Fife, Washington. Uh, we're in our beautiful indoor showroom here, and today we're going to feature the new arrival, the 2020 Winnebago Navion 24J. This is on the new generation uh, Sprinter uh, uh, chassis here. Got a lot of new upgrades um, that would take uh, a long time to go into, but let's give you a brief uh, kind of walkthrough here. You got your full body paint uh, and that nice fiberglass cap, very aerodynamic. Um, also, uh, swinging down here along the side here, you've got your awning. It's actually partially out right now, but it's integrated into the side of the coach there. So again, very aerodynamic when you're going down the road. Um, also, they've uh, upgraded this door here. Um, it keeps that road noise um, very solid um, and very well insulated door. Here you got your uh, steps uh, that will automatically pop in and out for you. Uh, great storage uh, compartment here. Uh, does have an access point uh, down here so you can plug things in uh, if you want an exterior TV or, or whatnot there. Um, you got your Truma uh, Arcogo uh, hot water system here. Uh, very efficient. You've got your uh, your 4,000 watt uh, or 3,600 watt own-in generator, uh, very quiet, and then your propane uh, right access there for your grill. Um, so under here, under the awning, got your grill and all that set up here. Swing around, take a look. Uh, more storage uh, right there. This is kind of located underneath that corner bed, um, and then the compartment below uh, is as well. Back here, you got your uh, access ladder to the uh, one-piece fiberglass roof, integrated backup camera there, 5,000-pound um, tow hitch uh, with your seven-way plug there as well. You've got the new uh, uh, tail light design here. Swing around on this side. You're going to have uh, your hookups, your outdoor shower, your uh, that's your 30 amp uh, power there in your sewer uh, uh, and gray water dump right there over here you've also got your uh, black tank flush um, just plug in the hose it'll help rinse out those tanks so you don't have those odors uh, going down the road here you've got a nice little extra storage space uh, they've added on here uh, you can always utilize uh, every bit of storage um, up underneath too, you do have more uh, uh, storage compartments uh, down there, uh, two side by side there. Also up above on the slide out, you do have what's called a slide topper. Uh, keeps uh, debris and, and everything from hanging out uh, up there when you're bringing it in and out. Let's, uh, let's go take a peek inside. All right guys, thanks for joining me inside. Uh, up in the uh, front cab area, you'll notice a new Mercedes dash uh, push start button. Um, and you've got all your, uh, your, your adjustable power seats on there as well. Um, up above, you've got a, uh, a nice bed for two. You've got your plug-ins and USB ports up there as well. Right above us, we've got an exhaust fan. Um, it's well located here and move that air out if you want. These front two seats also do swivel uh, as well. Swing around over here, you got your uh, U-shape uh, dinette, lots of storage underneath. This table's adjustable. These will flip out um, to add more space. Um, seat belts in here as well. Lots of storage up above. Swinging around over here in the kitchen area, you got your gooseneck faucet, double uh, stainless steel sink here, and your induction stove top here. Uh, also a gas uh, burner over there as well, residential style. Um, up here you do have your uh, TV and you've got your uh, storage behind it. You've got a paper towel holder in there. Uh, always trying to make uh, new additions uh, from what the customers are uh, asking for out there. Underneath here, plenty of storage. You've got your drawers here. Notice how they're lighted in there. So you can actually see what you're pulling out. And they are uh, uh, 
a soft, soft close, so no more slamming drawers around. Back here, you've got your uh, your fridge, freezer, good size. You got, actually got really great depth in here. It's probably really tough to tell on the video, but you can reach way that Normally, that's uh, you know six inches less in depth, so you can really stock this up for those longer trips. Slide out controls are located up high. That way small children or something can't get a hold of that. This does have 200 watts of solar as well. And then this is your command center here. You can start and stop your generator, get all your tank levels. Over here, you've got your uh, convection microwave oven. Also uh, great storage uh, down here as well. Got these pull out drawers. Got a nice great depth there. And then a nice big drawer down there below too if you had the you know spot for big pots and pans. Over here you've got your uh, uh, sink here that's outside the bathroom so that way uh, you can kind of utilize someone's in there you're still not having to use the kitchen sink to brush your teeth. Back here uh, you got your corner bed. Lots of storage up above here. This is all Nice depth and, and height in there. Got your TV here as well. Turn some more lights on there. And back here in the bathroom. Got, here, let me turn that on. Nice big shower, plenty of headroom, and plenty of leg space. I'm sure you have a lot more questions to go into. Um, Call 253-286-0833, ask for Hugh. I'd uh, love to help answer your questions and come in and take a peek in person.